Hey guys, welcome back to me screaming. Ah. Hey guys. It's eight o'clock in the morning. Now for me, during summer, this is really early. I swear I haven't gotten up before maybe 12 in the past two weeks. I was up in the kitchen last night, half five, eating soup. So that gave me about two hours sleep. Basically, I go back to school in a week. And like, obviously in school, you can't have any nails on or like eyelash extensions or like, I wouldn't dye my hair or anything nice for school. So today we're gonna like kind of naturally enhance our appearance. Kind of not natural, but like, Trying to look like a naturally pretty girl because we're not. <laughs> so first step is eating healthy. Well, we actually do need to get on top of our shit here because my formal or prom or whatever you want to call it is in two months. No, I haven't done anything to prepare for this. So we're actually starting to buckle down. We're starting to buckle down. Sorry. Anyone see that dance? TikTok? Yeah. So we started off this morning with some Greek yogurt. This was really, really hard for me because I went into the cupboard and I saw choco hips and I was like, I would so like to be eating you right now. But here I am, here I am, it's okay. Let's just have a wee taste. So good, so good. Okay, so then the reason I'm up so early is because we're going to the gym at nine o'clock. I know, it's unheard of on this channel, you're, you're shook. But it's true, I am going back to the gym for the first time since April. Since my first video, like four months ago. I'm not gonna do much, and also I have got a really bad ingrown toenail today, so I won't be able to do much. <laughs> That's my excuse. No, but like, it actually is really sore. I've got a chronic ingrown toenail. Oh my God, off topic, but I have something to tell you. We need a stand name. Have you thinking about this? The toenails. What do you think? It's like toe, and then my name, like N-E-I-L-L. -L. Like you can be a toenail if you want. Let me know if you're interested. Yeah, so what else we're getting done today? We are going to the gym, getting a sunbed because we want to be naturally tan. We don't want to be wearing like fake tan shit. We do like fake tan, but just if we can keep this tan going, like I'm just, I'm not, it's not bad, okay? I think I've got one sunbed since I came home from holidays. I just want to like keep up my tan a wee bit if I can, like from holiday. And then whenever it starts to fade, I'll use fake tan and all. We're getting like a treatment done on her hair because I don't want to dye it again because sis, my hair is broken. She's really, really struggling. She's holding on for dear life. So as much as I would love to dye it back silver, it's not happening. I'm just gonna put like a treatment on it today to revive it like a wee bit. Also, I have my hood up because do you wanna see the situation I'm working with right now? I woke up like this. Going to get a facial. And it's like probably one of those fancy facials. So really excited about that. I haven't really got a facial before. Oh my god. Oh my god. I didn't tell you. Results of a few days ago. No, I, I knew I did bad. Like I literally, for GCSEs, I put in absolutely zero effort and came out like really, really well. So I was like, perfect. I'll do the exact same for my AS levels. No. I knew physics had gone badly, but I thought in my head that I'd surprise myself and get like maybe a B and a C. B and a D. B and Mars, D and physics, fantastic stuff. Well done, Olivia. I just don't know what happened there, but it's okay. We're resetting it next year. Fuck my life. Oh, by the way, I also did drama, so that's why it's all at the end of next year. I only had two results this year, but like, I only had two exams this year. You'd think I can be maybe better than a D. CBA. After our facial, we're getting our nails done. I know it's kind of fake and it's looking naturally pretty, but my nails are like, paper thin and then like I just keep biting them and it's not a good look so I'm gonna get like nude acrylics on because school don't really care if you have nude nails. I'm gonna eat this and I tried it but it's kind of revolting and then let's get headed to the gym. I can't believe those words are coming out of my mouth. You might not recognize me in my active wear. Oh me? Sorry I'm just off to the gym here. Sounds pretty good doesn't it? Oh what did I do this morning? I just went to the gym. Okay should I do some like warm up sprints? Good boy. Chill out. Find your zen. Right, hey, I just need, I just need to do it. Right, I just need to fucking go. Let's just hop in the car. I can't. Come on, Olivia. Fucking do it. I can't. I'm too shy. So 
I would say that this lighting just makes me look really red, but I probably also am really red and sweating and shy because I'm just sitting here looking at this gym and like I can't physically bring myself to go in. Luckily the car park was quite quiet, which means it won't be packed because usually like if I go here during like a weekday on school and um, it's like any teen you could think of goes to this gym. Like, I don't care if you don't live here. Like, if you don't live in this country, they go to this gym. Like, this specific one, for some reason. Every single person you know goes to it. So, I'm hoping because of what day is it? It's, like, a Wednesday at, like, 9 o'clock that no one will be here. I'm, I'm leaving, if there is. If I see one person I know, out we go. Mission aborted. Abort mission. Oh, fuck. My brain's like a smoothie. Jesus, I cannot go back to school. They're gonna be like, why did you get a D? And I'm gonna be like... It's hot girl summer, so I don't care about my day. Right, come on, let's go. Woo! Woo! <laughs> I can't do it. I can't do it. Come on, Olivia, come on. Am I crying? I <laughs> think I'm crying. You know what it is? I want to be skinny for more, like, proper skinny that, like, when I stand to the side, you actually can't see me. I'm gonna put Jenna Marbles' podcast all on my earphones, and we're just gonna have to fuck shit up in there. Pure Doom will not know what it hit, hit it. <laughs> Okay, it's literally empty and um, I'd like to thank not only God but Jesus for that. Help me. I don't think I'm ever gonna come back here. So I was there for a total of 30 minutes, but you know what, it's my first time so maybe I'll build it up to an hour. Probably not. I went on the treadmill and I was like, I'm gonna do a 5k. And then it got 10 minutes in and I was like, right Olivia, grow up, stop. I'm, I was literally about to have a stroke and my legs were going to give in. And then I was like, right, I'll go like follow a 10 minute ab tutorial. So then I went to the mats and did one sit up and genuinely thought I was going to be sick. Oh my god, look how red I am. I literally had to go to the toilet after I was running because I was like, this is so embarrassing. Like I am dripping in sweat if anyone sees me. Like there were like full grown like men there and I was sweating more than them. So, so now I'm in a bad mood because that went so shit. So I'm just going to go get a sunbed, cheer myself up. <laughs> I went home and got a shower and all and I'm all nice and clean now went and got a coffee because I woke up what at like 8 today that's really really early for me I had about 2 hours sleep and I am going out tonight I know I know I'm like trying to make myself all naturally pretty and then I'm gonna go home and like cake my face and makeup but like go crazy go stupid you know what it is I don't know what go crazy go stupid is from but I've heard other people say it and I really enjoy it so I'm gonna say it now so like I can't give you any context, we just enjoy it. You know just like how small Belfast is? I went to get this coffee and like my mum was just like in the Starbucks and I was like, she was like, like how weird, how random, how stupid, how crazy. <laughs> also you don't have a metal straw today, but don't come for me. Cause I will kill your whole family. Don't worry about the turtles, worry about your family. So yeah, going to get, I don't, I literally have no idea. Like one time I was at the hairdressers and saw that they did a treatment and I was like, oh, that sounds fun. Let's go do it. I need to stop spending money like this. Like this is so unnecessary. I probably could have got like a hair mask or something from Tesco's, but here we are. That yogurt just didn't fill me up. I am absolutely ravenous. If you're wondering why I got a black coffee today, it's because I'm a skinny legend now. I said this about once a week then i'm gonna be a skinny legend it lasts about two days but you know what i actually prefer a black coffee from starbucks to one with milk because their almond milk tastes like absolute piss like i am convinced this is how they make their almond milk they put in almonds in a blender and then they just piss all over it and then blend it up and that's their almond milk because it is absolutely revolting after that gym session that half an hour gym session my anger and toenail has flared up i knew it was a bad idea i should have never gone back from the hairdresser it's just basically looks the same on the way home i stopped off at mark spencer's and got some of course because they're being skinny some health shots so for lunch we're having some carrot and coriander soup it looks like i shot in a bowl skinny dip sent me some stuff over and look how pretty that case is oh it's riding oh my god yeah so then whenever i was at the hairdresser is my hairdresser who like dyes my hair came over and was like why are you so blonde and i was like i don't know sis and he was like, tea. Right, taste test for our shots. I bet you these do fuck all, but like in my head, they like fully rejuvenate all your organs, which I need right now. I need like a full organ transplant and a face transplant. Is a face an organ? No, your skin is an organ. But you didn't know that. You definitely did. I actually, I would drink that. And you know what it is? How is that a shot? How can anyone get that down their throat in one? 
Also, oh my god, last week I was out and the bartender started giving me free apple sour shots and I was like, sis, you need to stop. I'm about to be on the floor. Okay, this looks absolutely horrendous. It's citrus and ginger and it has three chilies. I was just sick of my mouth. What the fuck is the spiciest thing I've ever had in my life? Oh, whoops. Ugh. I've been burned, I think. I'm suing Marks and Spencers. I started Lucifer, which is like a TV show. So I went on Netflix, like started it from the start. And I was like, you know what? Two episodes in, I was like, I'm like a bit confused here. Like, I don't really know what's going on. But at the same time, I was like, I have no brain cells left. I got a day in physics. Like, of course, I don't understand what's going on because I have the mental ability of a fucking seven year old then i realized hold on a minute i'm watching season four it's fantastic right so it's like great little bit start from season one go on to start from season one there's only season four why would they do that i think netflix are trying to prank me let me tell you about the facial before i go because i'm about to i'm gonna leave in like half an hour. shit i need to leave soon basically my friend ethan's mum is like a not a beautician like she does like really cool facials and like lip fillers and botox and all honestly like second i turn 18 i'm going to her to get my lip fillers done like her lip fillers are so good and she was like come get a facial with me and i was like sister so that's where i'm going to get my facial i'm going my brain is it just it's just not there anymore <sighs> I used to be so smart, like I actually was so smart. And GCSEs have got like fucking five eye stars, and now I, I can't, I can't form a sentence. I got a D in physics. I got an A star last year, and I went down to a D. So <laughs> we're not thriving, but we're thriving because we're a skinny queen. So let's see if I have a six pack yet. Uh, 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 uh. Do I have one? Oh, carrot and coriander soup. I love you, bitch. I ain't never gonna stop loving you, bitch. Okay, so here with Tanya. Say hi. <laughs> so she just squeezed some of my spots because I had a bit of acne. They're bleeding. So I look like a dinner lady, but we're gonna start. Right, so we're doing this like thing called pro facial, and she's like sucking the stuff out of my skin, which is literally what Kylie Jenner does. So I'm kind of thriving. And then I, I'd be able to see like all the gunk that was in my skin. So I'll show you. I'll show you the stuff that comes out of my skin. Nice, yummy. But a lot of that was like wee black hair, something that gave actually a bit of blood on it as well, because I've obviously- Oh my god, oh that's gross, I'm disgusting! <laughs> okay, right, so we've finished the um, all the sucking out, and we're gonna put on a mask now. So we finished, I forgot to film the mask, but she did like this really cool mask and like pushed it all in instead of just like leaving on my skin. And look at my skin, ah, it's glowing! I want one every week now. <laughs> This is awful, this is an addiction, this is my new sunbed addiction. Buenos dias, muchacha latas. Bueno, bu buenos dias, muchacha latas. Muchacha latas. I don't even know what that means. I just remember seeing the Freddy, Freddy Benson vine. Freddy Benson. Is that his name? Barry Benson? Did I just hit puberty? The B movie? Ah! Right, so we just got my nails. Right, okay, yeah, you're thinking, Olivia, they are so long. See what it is, right? The girl was like, so how long do you want them? And I was like, not that long because I've got school. Like, I'm starting back to school and stuff. Can't do my shirt buttons when I've got nails on. What's this whole thing? I'm receiving hairline, very good. She's like, how long do you want them? And I was like, not that long. And she's like, so this long? And I, I, I just can't say no. So I was like, fuck it, go on then. They're far too long. Well, no, they're not. They look really nice, but just for functionality, like it's not gonna be a good situation. Hopefully don't take any big poos in the next three weeks because this will be a severe problem. So this is me all natural and this is me naturally beautiful. Now I'm gonna ruin it and kick my face in makeup to go out, so. You know why I actually made this video? I was just too shy to say earlier, but I feel like I'm gonna tell you. So I was reading my comments the other day and I saw that someone comment being like, oh, you're so pretty, which is like <laughs> my heart. And then someone replied to it saying, I go to the same school as her and or like my sister goes to the same school as her and she like looks so different in person and I was like really <laughs> well like oh <laughs> it is a video I have no makeup on in any of them like how can I look different but then I'm like maybe in school like I just let myself go like I don't put any effort into my parents like maybe I need to start doing that like that's why I tried to improve like my natural things because I'm not gonna wear makeup to school am I so like that's basically why, why I did this video because like one I let one hate comment get to me but like why would you ever say that to someone literally still 
raining outside and I'm like not really vibing with this. I I just don't want to go out. Like I'm not in the mood either. Also, I feel violently ill. I don't know what it is. It's like a big knot on my stomach. You know what I think? Depression. Okay, guys, I was gonna properly video me doing my makeup, but I don't think that's gonna happen right now because I'm in a bit of a rush now. So I'll show you my makeup. I had a stroke. I'll show you my makeup whenever it's done, but it's not gonna be very good because I'm actually gonna go sick of it because I've only got like a half an hour. Ready? Ready to see me fully caked? Whoa! Whoa! She's a catfish. Hopefully, now when I go back to school, I won't have people saying I look like different in person. Fuck. Honestly, I'm not butthurt about it. Kind of want to hunt this girl down and like cry to her, but anyway, no beef, no drama. When there's too much drama at school, all I gotta do is walk away. Yeah. When there's too much drama at school, all you gotta do is walk away. Yeah. Right, I'm gonna end the video now because I have to find an outfit and I'm having like a hernia thinking about it. Bye.